for week four, your homework is to not only add a web font to your page, but to finish your nav bar. And what I mean by finishing your nav bar is the following. Right now, my page looks like this. And it's okay, but if you've ever visited a web page, there's usually a nav bar at the top where there's a bunch of links kind of scrolled at the top where you can select from. So we want to go from this page to this. We want to have our title, and this is the nav bar that we want to have on our web page. So how do we go from this to this? This will be the first video that you'll watch to do that. The first thing that we'll want to do is we'll go over here to right now I've got um, my head, I've got my body. The first thing that we're going to do is create a header. So what we're going to do is right after body, hit enter, and then let's make a tag called header. We're going to close that. Okay. And now what I'm going to do is um, right after my unordered list, I'm going to close that header tag. So I want to keep the same things in this list uh, within my header. So right now I've got my header and I'm going to space these so that things look kind of neat and I can kind of identify it. This is part of good code to be able to make sure that things are spaced okay so that you can identify things clearly. So as I said, you've got a header right now. The next thing that I want to do is I want to get rid of this paragraph because all I want in my header is my title and then my links. So I'm going to get rid of this paragraph and I'm going to put it down after header. Okay, so now I've got my paragraph down there. Uh, what I should have is just my header, my H1, and my uh, unordered list. The next thing that I'm going to want to do is make sure that these are actual links. So since I don't have a website for it just yet, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put, uh, I'm going to make an uh, uh, anchor tag, ahref, you guys remember that, to send a link. And I'm going to put equals, quotation marks, and I'm going to put a hashtag in there because I don't know what I want that website to be. If I did, then I would put this in here already. But right now, since I don't have that, I'm just going to leave it as that um, that hashtag. So I'll go ahead and put in my hashtag right here and you'll notice that it becomes a link and then I'm going to close my eight anchor tag on the other side. Let's go ahead and copy this for the other uh, list items. Books, outside coding camps, and there's already one for the Latin School of Chicago. And then I want to go ahead and close my anchor tags here. Okay. So now I've got the first part of things ready to go. I've got my HTML done. And in the next video, I'm going to show you how to change or add the CSS.